AI and the environment, do they even go together? Many immediately think of huge data centers and high power consumption. But AI is also one of the most powerful tools we have in the fight against climate change. Google's AI warns people up to seven days before devastating floods, giving them vital time to prepare. Another Google tool called Greenlight helps city planners create green waves, saving time and CO2. And Fireset will use AI and satellites to detect wildfires when they are still tiny, just five times five meters anywhere in the world within 20 minutes. This has the potential to save forests, animals and, most importantly, human lives. For this, I also talked to Kate Brandt, Google's chief sustainability officer. So what we're finding is that AI is really powerful both from a climate mitigation perspective as well as making us more resilient to the impacts of climate. So I'll give you two examples. From a mitigation perspective, you may know about contrails, aviation contrails, those plumes we see behind jets. Those make up 1% of all global warming impact. And we have worked using AI models to better understand why contrails form and then to give pilots recommendations for how to avoid them because of altitude, weather, and other factors. And we found we can put, reduce them by half. So just think about that. One AI solution could reduce 0.5% of all global warming impact. On the resilient side, what we know is weather is becoming more extreme and we need to give people earlier warnings. So we've built a first of its kind flood forecasting model so we can give people early warnings seven days in advance to help get them out of harm's way. I think it's so great because these are things that are there, like you can do it immediately. So I think it's so cool that we live in an age where AI is really there to improve things. We can see it right now. I'm truly excited about all the possibilities here. Which projects do you find most exciting? Write it in the comments and check out sustainability.google for more information.